<laughs> we had nice. a reason for the slate. <laughs> right, welcome to the program. Well, hello. Hey, thanks for being here in the hairspray and joining us. What got you into acting? Okay, so I needed a class for high school. Like, I was my... Needed a class. Yeah, yeah it elective. was my... You had and nothing else better to do? And... No, well, <laughs> actually, I was in theater whenever I was a freshman. Okay. And I tried out for the play, kind of under the thing, like, because I didn't show up for the audition right, dates. Right. Yeah. So I kind of just auditioned during class with the teacher. You could teacher. do that? Well, I kind of asked him if I could. I made up an excuse. <laughs> of why I couldn't make it to the auditions, which was a lie, because I didn't think he'd actually let me audition. And he bought class, us. And he actually let me audition. Let so I was, like, I was like, oh. Okay, yeah. I auditioned, and he wanted me to do some part. I don't know. And yeah. I was like, oh, I can't. I was in football at the time. So I was like, oh, I have sports. And he was like, oh, okay. So same thing. The next year came around, he asked me to audition. And I was like, yeah. uh, still in football. I was like, can't do it. But I was just making excuses. Cause of course. I've never done anything that was like in front of people. So I was kind of nervous, I guess, and scared. Wait a minute. When, football's in front of people. <laughs> yeah, but it's not like... Okay, yeah, you got all this garb you got, on, yeah, you know it's, it's like a are. masquerade party, right? Yeah, 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 exactly. You blend in with everybody, right. so it's fine. Well, I came to my junior year at the end of it, and I needed a class. Right. So I was like, they were like either PE or choir. I was like, oh, I don't want to be in PE. <laughs> Senior year in Does PE. Does anybody like, want to be in PE? No, nah, I'm okay <laughs> with that. So I went to choir, Yeah. and I never sang before, never did anything. Really? Nope. And so I was like, uh, I guess this is something new. So I started singing, and it was fun. I liked yeah, it. Yeah. And then she was like, oh, hey, try out for the musical. And because, well, I was in dance my mm -hmm. junior and senior year. Right. And so she's like, oh, we need dancers for a part in sure. Sioux School. So I was like, oh, okay, I guess I'll try out. So me and three other of the dancers, yeah. actually one of them was Roy, Yeah. Um, we auditioned for the parts, and... It turned out I got a Wickersham brother. Okay. And so that's basically where it started. Also. Wow. I kind of got forced into it, and she, like, made me feel bad that I didn't audition. So yeah. I was like, all right, I guess I'll try out. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so now you got the grease paint. You know, you got the bug. What do you want to do that you haven't done yet? Like in acting? Anything. Acting, acting dancing, singing, whatever. Yeah. I want to be – I like dancing a lot. So really? Yeah, I enjoy dancing. Not too many guys do, but that's yeah, actually so, a good thing. Yeah, Especially I with like the girls. Yeah, yeah, that is true. <laughs> I um, any role that has to do with a lot of dancing, yeah, I really like. Yeah, and I really like the old school type, like for plays, like you mean like West, singing in the rain. That's coming yeah, up in a couple in the rain. years. Exactly, well, exactly. Yeah. I'm a tryout, so you got to try out. So why yeah. why, the old, why old school musicals? I don't know. I kind of like the whole old school theme with it, like. Greece, is it more the romantic like, part part of that, or is it what is what is it? I honestly don't know. No, kind no. of the clothing, the style. Okay. Yeah, the, yeah. I just enjoy it more. I think I was born in the wrong era. I don't. Well, it, it's very. I mean, think about it. You know, old style Hollywood. People were trained, right? Mm -hmm. If they decided you're going to be one of us, but you're going to go to class now. You know, mm -hmm. Classes in charm and dance, the whole, the whole bit, right? Because mm -hmm. they wanted you to be polished. Mm -hmm. And we don't really have that now for, for action singers. It seems it's like just, they just come on anything, anyone... anything goes. Mm, and yeah. if, if you're a pretty boy, pretty girl, some of that, that's most of it. But hopefully you can act a little bit. And Yeah. Yeah, so it's interesting. You like the old school stuff. Mm -hmm. Have you been to New York before? No, I have not. Oh, I've actually goodness. left the state one time. When was that time? A couple weeks ago. Went to, <laughs> went to Florida. You went to Florida, and it was Disney World, right? Yes. You did go to Disney World. Yes. You I did. went to Disney World for four or five days. Wow. Yo, it was actually really fun. Oh, absolutely. And I actually, it made me want to be a character there even more, because I've always wanted to be Aladdin. Yes. And going there and seeing it, I was like, and like seeing all the kids' reactions mm -hmm. to them, I'm yeah. like, I want to be Aladdin. Would like, you like so, to work there? Yeah. I That'd guess be. Sarah's got some tips for you. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, yeah. we have a couple of people in the cast, actually. I think Lindsay has also worked uh, there, too. She was worked there for eight years or something like that. Really? Uh, as a cast member. You mm. know, we don't... Yeah. You're not an employee. You're, you're a cast member. Mm -hmm. yeah, absolutely. <laughs> well, now that you've got your taste of traveling out of state, where, where else would you like to go? See, I heard, like, New York is good for, like, dancing and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. I don't... I honestly don't know. 
I mean, I liked it in Florida. I liked yeah. it going someplace different, di- right. different atmosphere, yeah. and like different environment, but not too sure. Really? Yeah. So what, I mean, now that you've seen of Florida, is there something about Texas that is just, just part of you? Or, you know, when you see the other places, like that, that's nice, but I... I'm still Texas boy at heart, but what is that? We're not, nah, not, not really. Not really. <laughs> Nothing particularly. <laughs> no, nah. I'm like, yeah. I don't see, like, yeah, I was born here, but I'm like, I think traveling would be a lot more fun than just staying yeah. in Texas. So, so like, did you give up on football? I kind of did. It was more of a, is that like, a size thing, or is it what? What's, or well, just, what was that? No, well, I just, well, I just well, well, I mean, you know, look at it. Look, I mean, like, no, we just had I'm, a professional football. You know what yeah, I'm talking about. Yeah, I A get typical you. football player now is like 300 pounds. Yeah, where 10, 15 yeah, years ago, you were 200 pounds, and that was big. And, you know, and my friend who used to be professional, used to an oiler, he says he does this now to the current football mm-hmm. players, and he's yeah. not that small himself. And he's going like, oh, gracious. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, how yeah. are you doing up there? <laughs> well, it was, I enjoyed it a lot. I um, didn't get along with the coaches very well. Yeah. That was one thing, but... It came down to it whenever I had breakdance tryouts because yeah. I, I wanted to try out freshman and sophomore year. Yeah, but I chickened out. I walked okay. in and I was like, "Okay, I'm." Not. <laughs> I was like, I didn't see anybody I knew, and I was like, "No, I'm not staying. I'm right. not sticking around here." Right. And I never danced before, so I was like, mm, "Not gonna do it. Not gonna try now." Right. Well, it came down like I became really good friends with two of the other dancers at the school, mm-hmm. and they kind of. Well, one of them walked to my class, and they were like, you, come on. It was like five minutes before the bell rang, and I was like, no. (laughs) But so I kind of went to the first tryouts, and it was during spring, I think it was spring ball, I think they called it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was, so it was my sophomore year, and the coach called me in the day of tryouts because the first two days we learned the routine, and then the third day we performed it. Well. It was the third day, and the coach called me into his office that day during the period, right. and he was like, you have to decide now, do you want to dance or play football? And I was like, I think I'll dance. I was like, Whoa. I'm good. And Whoa. so I kind of left that, and it was kind of freaky, because I was like two years with all my friends right. and all that, sure. and like a sport. And, yeah. But I kind of seen how everyone at the, like the dancers were, yeah. and I kind of, I felt safer there because I was like, yeah, I think everyone's friendly and yeah, yeah. nice and stuff like that. And not everyone's competing against you because, you right. know, in football, you compete for the position. Absolutely. That's so right. I felt like it was more everyone, mm-hmm. like, has to do their own part. And so I liked it a lot more. So now you're into dancing, man. Because I can tell you, there's always, that's hard. But hard, number one. Number two, there aren't that many guys yeah. that like to dance. So it sounds like you're going to... Got a lot of opportunities. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully. That's the idea. Yeah. What do you I, like to do when you're not doing dancing, acting, singing, or uh, now football that's all to the side? What the hobbies that you like to do? Um favorite T V shows? Yeah, I'm kinda into the lame T V shows. Like Teen like, Wolf and Pretty Little Liars and all those oh, little hey, you know what? Uh, <laughs> Honestly, to guilty be honest, pleasures. Guilty to be pleasures. Honest, Come on, guilty pleasures. Kind of into the yeah. whole mainstream yeah. type movies or TV shows. Can you tell? I mean, what makes them popular? I mean, you know what? Why you might like them? But what? Like, so they say, Teen Wolf, for instance. Why is that? Why is that in there? Um, I honestly could say probably because ninety percent of the actors and actresses. Not in a weird way, but they right. are attractive in ways. No, no, so no, no. Like, I understand. I understand. think that yeah. makes people want to watch the show even a lot more. I, I, I admit it. Uh, there was a guy I remember doing. We were doing a sh- uh, one of these original shows, a uh, stage show called Stephanie Hero. And a guy that was in the show had a laundry list of acting credits, you know, commercials, you, you know, and, and you look at it, it was impressive. Mm-hmm. And when he got on that stage, he couldn't act his way out of a paper bag. And I'm going, what the hell is it? The, the director would come up to me and say, Every time this guy's on stage, I want you to play the music. That wasn't good enough. Every time this guy's on stage, I want you to start the music, and I want you to build it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's like, what, the hell? What, what are we going to do? But he took direction like he wouldn't believe. If you said, I didn't like that. I want you to look this way. 
man, he took direction just like that. And it was like, whoa, that's why they wanted him. Mm-hmm. He could take direction and do really. And of course, he was a pretty boy, so that worked yeah. too. But yeah. So yeah, there, there's it was amazing that sometimes you'd be like, oh man, like the best talent, you know, kind of wins. And yet, now this guy took. They wanted somebody to take direction. That was mm-hmm. it, and he was good at it. Yeah, because he could turn it on. When you when you saw that, you're like, wow. But other than that, he couldn't think for himself. See, I'm mm-hmm. more into thinking actors, dancers. You know, yeah. you, you, you know improv, how to do it. You can imp- like, you can yeah. improv exactly. Uh, but yeah, it, it kind of depends what everybody you know wants different things. So yeah, I can understand that. Yeah, they want eye candy. Yeah, exactly. Because okay. if you works. honestly, if you pay attention to the movies and TV yes. shows nowadays. Acting is not really one of the strong sets of a lot of the people in them. Honestly. No, no, it's not. There's a lot. I've seen a lot better than what they have on TV. And which, which I suppose is why a lot of the uh, the original series, like Netflix and HBO, stuff like that, started to take off. You know, originally when the cable TV shows came out, or the, the channels, they thought, all we have to do is replay shows. Mm-hmm. And then they realized, no, we can't. We have to do original stuff. Mm-hmm. And some of that original stuff is really good. And it gives actors, you know, a chance to do some real stuff. Mm-hmm. You know, like what Kevin Spacey doing House of Cards or something like that. Mm-hmm. You know, you wouldn't get to do that probably on a regular channel or yeah. some of that. It just, you know, yeah, it gives you more. So like, there's some opportunities. opportunities, absolutely. So I think there's there's a lot of good opportunities out there. So what's ahead for you for the next several years? What are you gonna, what are you planning on doing? Um, right now, I'm kind of working at a studio as yeah. a dance choreographer for yeah. like kids, I guess you'd say, mm-hmm. like people like 13 and under. Sure. And it's like I enjoy that a lot. Yeah. But Honestly, I just hope to see like me still doing stuff like this, mm-hmm. like acting and dancing yeah. and being able to do that. But honestly, I have no no idea where I see myself. Kind of really? just taking it day by just day. Just take life as it goes. Well, you know, you need to be able to enjoy life. There's mm-hmm. nothing wrong with that, too. No. Yep. Well, we're glad to have you in Hairspray, but uh, we're going to ask you what I've been asking everyone else. <laughs> if heaven exists, what do you want God to say when you get to the pearly gates? I'm proud of you. No. Come on in. <laughs> you don't have to play football unless you want to. Yeah, no. We can dance. We can we, we can dance. dance party. That's a lie. I think there's even a song that way. <laughs> <laughs> All right, thanks for being with us. Well, appreciate glad it. to be here.